Hey now everyone, Vegetable here. And here we have the Martyr Legarius fight. Uh, this is not the first time I fought this boss. Uh, it's not the first attempt on this character, uh, obviously. And uh, it's not the first time I fought him, I, but I believe this is the first time that I actually beat him um, solo without uh, some co-op help. So that's something. And uh, again, this is my, with my Blade of Mercy. Um, uh, this goes so-so. Um, it's clear that I still haven't learned much about Legarius. Um, I've learned to avoid some of his right up in your face attacks because I think I got one shotted the last time that I fought him before this attempt. Like that one right there. Um, but um, I still haven't figured out this big globe that he launches in the air and explodes near you. Um, I get lucky a couple times, like right there. Um, but yeah, that thing just messes me up. Um, I think eventually I figure it out, but not in this fight. Um, of course, by this stage of the fight, it doesn't matter anymore. He doesn't really do that. Um, I have gone the parrying route with Legarius, but with the Blade of Mercy, I wanted to get in there and do as much quick step damage as I could. So that's what I keep doing here. Uh, he tries to do his you know, sword in the in the roof there. It makes a bunch of spinny swords in the air that come after you, but uh, knock that out pretty fast, so that was good. Um, did not realize that he could hit you clear through the, the uh, little roof and the spire there, but he surely can. Um, and at this point, I'm getting kind of frustrated. I'm like, you know what? I just want this to be over with, so I just start trading with not a good advisable way to go, but in this case it works out. I'm able to get enough damage done to finish off Legarius and get my first solo kill against him. So, there we have it. Very pleased with myself. <laughs>